and, and they have gone back to work. But the reason I'm raising this issue is, Malone, I don't want to come back to the court and say it's happening all over again. So let them just go on leave. I will give the names. Please Malone. give the names. That, yeah. Yeah. No, and I will and give it, the names as well, Malone. Chief Justice is saying it's for the state. Mr. Please. My application 21387 is specifically on this issue on behalf of doctors working across the state of West Bengal, where we have named specific individuals who are involved as part of the so-called mafia syndicate nexus, what are my law teams to call it? But this is the specific issue that we have identified that the underlying motivation and the interstate nexus, not intrastate nexus, which is singularly responsible for what has ultimately happened needs to be investigated. We have identified individuals in our application. That is the application number 213387. Now, so presently, we are looking, right. presently, we are looking at two aspects of Ajikor. Please. One, the actual incident which took place, Please. and the issue of financial irregularity. This is both beyond our now, is the entire It does go beyond our job. Absolutely. Now, but today, so, it's a question of doctors going back to work. The only question is that today, if we if we expand the investigation across other hospitals, Please. then we'll be in a situation where CBI will be left with an impossible situation. We are focusing on RG Court, but rest assured, thereafter, we'll see on what further to do. You have moved that application. That's important. At this stage, I think what you can do is you can, Mr. Solicitor, you can look at the uh, you can look at the IA, so that you know if there is any further, if if you know there is a need for broadening the investigation, you can apprise the court, and then we can pass whatever supportive orders are necessary to effectuate that purpose. Sorry. Because if this part, if this is a part of a broader of a broader nexus, either intra or interstate, then certainly this is a matter which we'll have to entrust to the CBI. Uh, of course, mm -hmm. but before we do that, we must have some uh, concrete materials yes, from we shall, the applicants, uh, which they must share with the CBI. No, well, well, we have been cautious. We have been cautious in sharing the material because of the investigation is pending. I said on, I have it in writing, but I'm not mentioning because the they names. They are not going to take action because of the various doctors or groups of doctors or associations who are coming up with their own grievances and asking. No, no, ask no, no, right no, in no, there. No, no, just a minute, please. On the last occasion, Malod, when the doctors met Malod, the CM, the Chief Minister, Malod, then they requested transfer of the Commissioner Police, the DC North, the Director Medical Education and Director Health Service, all of them have been transferred. Malod, they wanted resignation, now, my lords. Now resignation, dismissal, removal. So that's the whole problem. But he was given a... No, 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 no. The Commissioner of Police was given that, a promotion. For an inquiry, with, with that somebody Sorry. suppose that is challenged. That yes, is the, exactly. right? the resignation has no. Uh, could that even stand? Has Mark, action, which is, right, this is what they want. They are not making any such demand. Let them go and leave. Just allow me, brother. Now this is all of them signed it. So this is what they gave to us. We gave it to your lordship. Lord, the last may I just say, your lordship? Please. Now further, my lords. As and when, my lord, the CBI gives us, my lord, any information about any person, my lord, however high or low of having been involved a lot in something or that a lot his presence is not required he should be removed or he will be take it would action no, will be I taken would against only request, them. My Lord, i would only no request, difficulty i would request my Lord, them to yes. give me those names in a sealed cover i will pass it on to cbi no and to the state this one a fourth status report dated 30 september 2024 uh, by the uh, dig so, head of branch, special crime dash one CBI has been submitted to the court. The status report indicates the leads on the investigation, which are being followed up by the CBI and the steps which have been taken in the course of the investigation. Next, during the course of the hearing, former learned counsel appearing on behalf of the resident doctors have submitted uh, mm -hmm. their concerns to the effect that uh, first of all, I just don't say that learning council uh, without uh, first of all, at this stage it would be inappropriate uh, at this stage where the investigation is in progress it would not be appropriate to set down the details of the investigation or the leads which are being followed by the CBI since that would compromise the status and effectiveness of the investigation. Put stop. Uh, at the same time, 
uh, learned counsel appearing on behalf of the resident doctors uh, don't say at the same time the CBI comma as it appears before the court is conducting an investigation on two facets colon first the, act, the alleged rape and murder which took place on 9 August 2024 at Ajikor Medical College and Hospital and second uh, the allegations in regard to financial irregularities uh, which was also entrusted for the investigation of the CPI by the Orders Division Bench of the Calcutta High Court. So stop. Whether each of these are completely disconnected uh, features or whether there is a relationship between the two is a matter again of investigation by the CBI. Good stop. During the course of the hearing, comma, learned senior counsel, learned counsel appearing on behalf of the resident doctors as well as their associations have drawn the attention, have drawn attention to the fact that I have drawn attention to the fact that uh, several persons against whom there are serious allegations of misdemeanor in the, um, the in the medical college and hospital are still occupying positions of responsibility. Good stop. The status report which has been submitted by the CBI indicates that several as several of these aspects are still under investigation. Stop. Uh, responding to the uh, so responding to the submission, the submission of the doctors to the effect that the persons in positions of responsibility at the medical college and hospital should either be suspended or be directed to be uh, proceed, on proceed on leave uh, is a matter which would require uh, examination by the state government as the as the appointing and disciplinary authority. Full stop. Uh, Mr. Rakesh Dwayji, <laughs> learned senior counsel appearing on behalf of the state of West Bengal, has submitted that uh, if, if the CBI would share with the state government uh, such preliminary material which would indicate the complicity of any person in uh, persons in positions of authority, comma, the state government will duly take necessary action in accordance with law consistent with the service rules and regulations. Full stop. That apart, comma. Uh, in the event that it appears that the that that that, that the that the irregularities which are noticed uh, in the context of the RG Corps Medical College and Hospital uh, 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 cover not just the uh, the hospital in question, hospital and medical college in question, but extend to other such institutions within the state, within or outside the state, comma. So uh, the court may be uh, <coughs> the the investigating team of the CBI may be informed uh, along the modalities which have already been prescribed by the earlier orders of this court. Uh, thereafter, comma the court may take a call on uh, what further directions to the CBI uh, would be required to ensure that the investigation covers other aspects which which, which may travel uh, beyond the uh, incidents which have taken place. At the RG Corps Medical College and Hospital. Yeah. Good Melod, I have a request. I have a record. request to make. Melod. Now, Melod, sorry, Melod. I have one request. Melod. Uh, we, if you say, uh, a the a fresh application uh, being IA number two one double three eight seven of twenty twenty four. Two one double three eight seven eight seven of two thousand and twenty four, which has been uh, filed in that regard, please, uh, is taken on the file. Great. Uh, full stop. Details of the IA may be shared with the investigating officers of the CBI. Investigating officers. Will your lordship be kindly record? Will not my IA number? Was I? I have a request. Now, just one second. Now, I have one a little bit time to for Mr. Duvedi. Mr. Duvedi, between the last order and this order, uh, today's hearing, what steps have been taken by the state of West Bengal for the installation of CCTV yes, cameras? We have filed. We have filed an F. Uh, two for providing additional security. Three for constructing duty rooms, which are separate from male and female doctors, for construction of toilets, for providing biometric access to, to critical areas of hospitals. What are what steps? What is the present improvement? In the we have filed an affidavit, Lord, today, Lord, in the morning. What have you What have you now, uh, done? We have shown the progress, Lord, in that, but we need some more time, Lord, to complete the task. Okay. Okay. Kindly have paragraph eight. That page. Page five. 
visit ILMS Academy for various courses from contract drafting, RTI, labor law, GST and more. Get certified to enhance employability. There have been some logistical delays not because of release of funds and all that. Otherwise, floods and, and floods in the state. floods. Floods in the state of the state. You have to but take still, action now. Mm -hmm. How many new CCTV cameras have been installed? Tell us. Because that. we have we mentioned CC at page five, you know, the paragraph eight, last bottom, you know, it... six one seven eight were to be installed. You know, Twenty six percent have been installed you know, up till, and remaining we are likely to complete by tenth of October. You know. And so far as RG core is concerned, it is at page paragraph eleven. Just that no part of the work is above fifty percent. Duty rooms forty nine. That's right. Washroom forty percent. Lighting arrangements thirty three percent. CCTV yeah. installation twenty six percent. Why is the progress so tardy? Because, because I mean we have been monitoring this now for quite since 9th of August. Because end of September. tender etc had to be floated because of all those. But we are like we'll complete all this road by maximum fifteenth October. You have said 31st of October, completed by 15th of October now. I'm saying 15th. I've told them a lot myself. They wanted time to be 31st so that we don't have to revert back for more time. But I want your lordships to post it by 15th of October Lord, so that by that time, Lord, we can give your lordships. Most of the work will be completed. Lord. And so far, RG core is concerned, Lord, duty room, Lord, uh, tenders, etc. have matured, but the, we have to take permission. Who's, looking from the, who's now the principal at the RG Core Medical College and Hospital today? Has somebody been appointed? Dr. Manas Benerjee. He's come from outside or he was a doctor within actually? He's from Cal Cal Bengal only. No, but he was within RG Core or he's come in from. No, he was place? four years back, he has been in RG Core. Of, uh, medical college. Which medical college? Parasat Medical College. Parasat Medical College. And later on, sir, he was after this incident, we reviewed his reputation. I, I knew him. So he was earlier MSVP of Arjikar almost four years back, very efficient officer. So we got him back as a principal because he was already promoted. And one of our best MSVP, Dr. Sakshi who was there in Bakura College. We also got him. He's a young guy and he has developed quite a good reputation and a comfort with the resident doctors. And both of them are very well educated within the city. So you are the uh, health. Secretary. He's the principal secretary, Lord Health. The uh, principal secretary health of government of West Bengal, who is present in the course of the hearing, uh, has informed the court that uh, following the incident which took place on 9th August 2024, uh, the state government has brought in two officers uh, as uh, the principal of the medical college and hospital and as the medical superintendent and. Vice and vice principal. Full stop. These officers are Pullen, bracket one. Manas, Dr. Manas Banerjee. Professor Dr. Manas Banerjee, yes. who was earlier okay. working as the principal, assigned, who was earlier posted as principal at the Barasat Medical College. At Barasat Medical College, semicolon, and bracket two. Uh, Dr. Professor Dr. Saptarshi Chatterjee. Professor Dr. Saptarshi Chatterjee. He was as a MSVP of Bakura Sammelini Medical College. Was previously posted as the medical superintendent and vice principal of the Bakura, 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 Bakura Medical College. Uh, the status report, which has been submitted by the state of West Bengal, uh, indicates the following position in regard to the ongoing and ongoing works. Work at 28 medical colleges, eight March ko A ek to copy karlo. As regards the uh, status of the work at the RG Medical College, the status report is in the following terms: page six or seven ko B D. Though the uh, the state has indicated that the remaining work would be completed within a time frame of uh, 31 October 2024, the court has been assured. That all work would be completed by 15 October 2024. We will make all endeavors, Mulas. Some little thing will remain. Let the state will make all endeavors to complete the work by 31, 15 October 2024. 
to stop the state shall positively ensure that work is completed by 15 October 2020. It's not to push the point. In RG Corps, one moment. If the state clerk has been going on for at least two decades, and if the individuals who have now been appointed have been associated with the Lord, can, can the state please then finish? The fact that the previous employment was not with RG Corps doesn't make a difference. No, no, but. Okay. I know, but you know, sometimes what happens is that merely because they have, uh, he was appointed, he was with RG Corps four years back, at least he may not be involved in anything at all. But if he's so disclose whether the individuals had previous relationship with RG Corps, let them at least disclose. Malad, but that is the most shocking part of it. Because four years back, my Lord, what? You know what? Sometimes you need a person who is conscious of that particular establishment also. If that person is otherwise free of taint, and today the government is bringing in somebody from outside, there's no reason for us to suspect that a person who is deliberately brought in with a taint. Yes, my lord. Oh, you took instruction. And we are told that immediately the doctors are not uh, aware of any taint, but we will come back with specific may, instructions. May I, in RG Corps College, Lord, we, regarding duty room, Lord, the tenders have matured, but we need the CBI's clearance, Lord, because uh, of the crime. Mr. Uh, Solster, I'm sure, Lord, will. They need your clearance for uh, completing the work in the duty duty room because you have lifted whatever all the evidence were, now. Whatever they were supposed not to do for first five days, Lord, they have done. Now, even if they do something more, we have no objection. Anyway, you just communicated to them. That's all. Yes, that's all right. Sir, it's, aspect, it is the CBI years, which has stopped us, Lord. So we need permission. Otherwise, we would have done it. Lord, four years back, when this no, particular person was have baby company, company, we thought, have more Lord, yes, he problems. was responsible for selling up babies. Or the matter is pending before the no, high court. This is unfair. This, this is unfair. But it's not unfair. Yeah. One second. I don't know from all these remarks. Actually. Let CBI investigate. You, invest in I, you can't who are you? Who one second. No, no, I have the order sheet. Just, just one but second. Who is who is one who is second. Who listen to us. You can't just throw an allegation yes. like that across the bar. Responsibility. On the next date of listing, you show us something to indicate. No, no, I'll show the orders where the DNA was conducted right. by the high court. Put it on the record. I'll put it on record. The record. You can't just, you know, no, otherwise you have to. That. We have to follow some order this and is procedure not in the court. I'll put it on the court. Yeah, 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 yeah. We'll immediately ask them to replace the order. He, he should also tell us what is his locus for where he is getting I mean, information. Yes, or but my but argument, it was. All right. See. Look, you put it on the record. I'll put it. And which party does he represent? I have a submission. Because may I may I have a very important request to make? Sure. My learned friend said that all doctors have joined, but they have joined, but only they are performing emergency work. Oh, just a minute, fellow. This they is a false statement. It's a false statement, and right. but, but it is in their rap statement. Uh, yes. Indira Jai Singh, yes. senior counsel appearing on behalf of the resident doctors, has uh, made a solemn statement that pursuant to the hearing which took place in court on the last occasion, all doctors have rejoined their duty. Well, Lord, they were the expression that I've used. Responding to the responding to the responding to the statement of uh, Mr. Rakesh Vedi. Learned they are not counsel. doing IPD and OPD. Second. That learned senior counsel appearing on behalf of the state of West Bengal, that the doctors are not performing IPD, and, IPD OPD. and OPD duties, comma, Ms. Jaising assures the court that, that the doctors are performing all duties without exception. Including all essentials and emergency services that may be recorded. All duties. No, not because there's a dispute over the expression. Essential, the essential services are being performed. You're not performing only essential services, right? No, you are performing all duties. We take it from you. No. you and they have admitted it in their own affidavit. You are performing no. all duties. We have said not IPD, yeah. OPD. This, this is yeah. part of the and threat. Is, I, am, I am not accusing, but I am only this praying. Is not hold it and the of doctors the doctors. Not. So therefore, we have recorded your statement it's that you are puja. performing all duties. So now abide by the statement. No, these uh, duties and, are performed by the senior doctors. Uh, uh, now, uh, not one. Alos, they've admitted it in the affidavit that the junior doctors have rejoined. So no, where is there is this? Please show us the so they have the para number. You know it. Well, to your knowledge, they have rejoined. To your knowledge. Senior doctors. Please show us. Words can only be seen, Alos. What we have said. statement that they are willing that they are ready that they are doing all all work so they are not doing so are, no, please this is this cannot be allowed let him file a separate application for Para 17. Ms. Jai Singh, are you making a statement that you are performing ipd and opd work what yeah yes here's my statement please record it as i say it 
they are performing all essential and emergency what services. Is essential? Let, what me, is let me finish. Services includes OPD. Essential services. One minute. Visit ILMS Academy for various courses from contract drafting, RTI, labor law, GST, and more. Get certified to enhance employability. They should know better than me. They are doctors. Are very important for they the health know system. better than me. Hospitals cannot. If according to you, you are performing all essential services. Yes. We record your statement. That includes right. IPD and OPD. Uh, OPD is part of essential services. Right. It's likewise in patient I want it on record, my lord. I want it on record that they are performing emergency and essential services. That's the medical name. My lord, it's the medical name given but, to this service. But will that mean that you will not render services to a child who comes in with a normal ailment during the term of the weather, but you will try and save uh, no, the dying patient? No, my lord, no. No, OPD Your falls OPD within essential services. In the hospital, OPD which any doctor falls doctor. within the essential services. Not essential services, all essential not services including essential IPD, services. OPD. It's not the way they have admitted that we are back at work. No, no, we continue not. like this. I will take no responsibility for one more strike. Okay, for one second. Are you therefore, uh, are you stating that you are performing all medical and essential work, including IPD and OPD work? Because it's part of essential service. No, Lord, your Lordship may record that. I don't want confusion. You don't want to make any false statements in this court. Categorically stated that all the doctors are, are and shall perform all medical and essential work, including IPD and, and IPD and OPD work. Yes, I'm grateful. My Lords, in all of this, there have been two attacks. On the 27th yes. of September in Shagor Dotto Medical College Hospital, there was an assault so, when the mob entered and the police and the uh, non-state security personnel, the Rati Reshati said that they are doubling down on, stood back. So, my lord, there is a second attack that happened yesterday. My lord, if I may just... That you are investigating. This is not a general investigation on to what, what is happening on yes. uh, issues of law and order in every hospital. Yes. But we take it that you are taking action in accordance with it. We have filed no, 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 My Lord, in this FIR regard, the action the, is not the being taken. The two versions are that a patient died because, my Lord, he was not provided bed. He was critical. The doc, no doctor attended. No, Only my lord, these are no, these I allegations can't. cannot but be made, my lord. These allegations just, cannot be made. But surely we can't decide them on, on the level of the volume of the voice. He'll have to decide it if at all after, but after records come before us. Exactly, my lord. Yeah. There are no records. Yeah. There's an assertion by the state. Yeah, We're denying it. Yes, let, we have put yeah, it on records. Let them reply. Every lordship is carried physically away. But I'm huh? the nearest yeah. proxy. No, I'm the nearest. There are. Just All right. Uh, I'm just a minute. My lordships, may I? All right. Just uh, Mr. Solicitor, when will you give us the report on the status when of the investigation? The next. Uh, uh, we'll, we'll take it up on the Monday after the mini break uh, of the okay. court. So that will give, give you almost 10 days time to investigate. Of course. Yeah. Yeah. My lord, my lord, Dean. Your lord, lordship, may I just mention for a second? second. Your Lordships, may I mention Lord, please that me one second. sensitive nature of the pictures I've taken those back? Your Lord, Lord, yeah. One second. Is it in relation to the uh, state of West Bengal and the Ajay Kaur hospital? Your Lordship, this is the response. One second. Yes or no? No. Then that is the end of the matter. Sorry. No. Lord, 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 no, sorry. Lord, a word of clarification Lord, that the High Court can proceed with the other petitions, my Lord, which are outside the limit of what your Lordships are supervising. Yes, dear. Yeah, no. uh, that's a dip. Last Mr. Lani, if we wanted the High Court to stay its hand, we would have indicated that right away. So that we didn't. It's can, a, can have a specific there, are, there are issues of moment which we are considering. There are issues which are best left to be handled at a local level by the division. Exactly. Level. But they also know that issues which we are dealing with, they will not touch. Lord, Other matters last, they can... last time they had a difficulty. I was personally appearing in the matter in the Calcutta High Court. What was the issue? The difficulty was, is this also, you know, the, the, the case was about the police commissioner's statement immediately on the morning of, <clears throat> as he exited from the hospital, giving an interview, disclosing the victim's name. Somebody will have to file a writ petition. Yes, yeah, fellow, we filed a writ petition to the High Court. Have we, have we stayed the hearing of that writ petition? We have not. Have we transferred that writ petition? No, no, Lordship, have it. But, but a word of clarification the difficulty. But, yeah, yeah.
Now, your Lord Chancellor only say this. Anything outside the limit of what your Lord Chancellor said. Uh, yes. Mr. 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 Uh, Mr. Dwedi. If there's a repetition dealing with the police commissioner's conduct, we are not uh, we are not staying the proceedings <laughs> before the high court at all. It so please, neither side should tell the court that well we are seized of that matter. We are very clear that the repetition which has been filed. But will your lordship say that anything outside the limit of what has been said? It's not required to be said. Uh, the high court is seasoned enough to know what well, to time, enter upon. Last time we said that it was not going into Now we have made our position clear. Yeah. The national task force be directed to file the yeah. uh, Mr. Solicitor, now uh, could we have the report of the national task force on the next day? Can we? Because then we can issue uh, broader directions yes, for implementing. Correct. So please I make sure. Indicate, uh, Malod, because we had said that an interim report and the final report. Now we should have actually both. Mr. Solicitor General shall uh, place on the record the outcome of the proceedings before the National Task Lord, Force Lord, or at least apprise this court on the status, uh, on the progress which has been made. Well, Lord, but your Lordship will just give me one second on the task force. Why? Dr. Joshi from Medical Legal Society of India. Sorry? Dr. Rajiv Joshi from Medical Legal Society of India. Have you filed an IA? Yeah, we have filed an intervention. What is your IA for? Are you, how are you concerned with RG Corp uh, Medical College? RG Corp in general violence all over India that is happening. That we will take up. We'll go step by step. We'll first deal with RG Corp. We are dealing with the state of West Bengal. We'll deal with this at a little later stage. I have to submit yes. these documents for your consideration. A single word on the question of the task force. My Lord, I have already filed an IA. I have no problem if it's taken up on the next date. But the point that we've pointed out there is the task force doesn't have any representation from West Bengal. We have made a humble request to this court. To one second, please. That is the, the task force is constituted by this honorable court. The members' names have been put by this honorable court. Only this court can alter the composition of the task force. It's a humble request to include into the task force at least one representative from the state of West Bengal. Yeah, one second. Uh, one second. Now, will you pick up your both sides? Will you please hear us? Yes. The task force is not state specific. It's the not. Task one second. That's right. We are going to issue directions based on the report of the task force, yes. which will have pan India application. Yes, my lord. If we agree to your suggestion, we will have to include <laughs> representatives of every state in the task force. But, oh, therefore, I, just one second. Yes. Therefore, we have directed that the task force shall engage with stakeholders. I understand. Please address an email on behalf of the resident doctors, both juniors and seniors in West Bengal, to the task force. Yeah. The cabinet secretary and his team are coordinating all logistical arrangements. They will ensure that you are heard by the task force. All your inputs are taken into account. Please rest assured. We agree. Sir, and, I want but that just I want one minute, Milot. One, one paper. Milot, just paper. one minute. This is not like what happens, you know, in no, a wait. conference of doctors. It's a court of law. Yeah, you, will, you will speak when you are called upon to speak. Also. Right? Uh, yes. Ask. Yes. Here yeah, you can talk. But Lord, just one more thing. I understand what has been put to me, that it's an all-India task force, <laughs> and therefore every state can't have a representation. However, having regard to the fact that this incident arose in West Bengal. Let's do this, Ms. Jackson. Please write an email right away to the convener of the task force. If they have not heard already the resident doctors from West Bengal, please request for an urgent appointment. You can then have a few representatives of all the associations meet them and give them a complete appraisal of what your concerns are, what your inputs are to the work of the task force. It will be a, it will be a welcome suggestion and they will give you a hearing. The Solicitor General is here. He will communicate it to the Cabinet Secretary. Lord, would your Lordship consider... Second, please, let me finish. Would your, would your Lordship consider appointing a sub-task force for West Bengal so that the specific issues which have arisen in West Bengal, which are not common to the rest of the country, can be looked into? You see, all the members of the task force are people of unquestioned national I, I don't question it no. and therefore the only point which you have made which is a valid point which is that the concerns specific to the doctors in west bengal will be taken into account therefore yeah. Jesse, all that you have to do is to address an email to the uh, to the cabinet secretary they will ensure that at the next meeting of the task force 
representatives of all the resident doctors are heard by the doctor. I will convey this to them for sure. We're going to but do that, my lord, on the, the next occasion. On the next stage of hearing, I'll briefly mention what they are. We do not want nomination of students, interns, and doctors. We want them to be elected representatives on the monitoring committee, the grievance committee, and the other committees. Your lordship may take it up for hearing. They have they the state has committed to facilitating elections. Right, but therefore this can be really addressed to the task force itself. No, my lord, not to the task force, to, to your lordships. No. I have put it in the... My lord, application. we'll do it on the next occasion, my lord. It's part of the agreed minutes. Grateful, lord. Oblige me. It's part of the agreed minutes, my lord. We're not now going to go into whether election should be held, nomination should be made. It we has must also be done, my lord. It we must be... also understand. We must also understand the limit it of... It can't be nominated people on the... My lord, the, please, please submit on the next, my lord. On the These next occasion, cannot have nominated people. They have to be elected, my lord.